is the Kings. So you just want to pack it in, make sure they don't get that ball to those young big ones inside, especially Cousins. Here's Marco for three. Picking up where he left off here on Wednesday. He's in a rhythm now, and it's good to see him in that rhythm. The Hornets, the Bees split their two with him gone. Credit to Jared Jack's work at the point. Here's David West off the dribble drive. Rebound batted out to CP. Belly with the ball fake. And drains the two ball. You can tell he's in a rhythm to make the ball fake, the dribble and the jump shot. He feels it's a star at Grand Lake here. Three and a half to go in the opening quarter. And his lead is two. And the turnover. Fourth. Sacramento turn. Bellinelli fouled as he was heading to the right. We talked about turning these guys over, that that's something you could do, and you can get something out of that turnover. Being young is, is the reason for both. Being young is the reason for the turnovers, but also being young is the reason they don't get back and defend fast break transition offense that well, because I don't think they know how to play that well. For 10 or more points in six of his last seven ball games, and 21 here on Wednesday, already up to six in the opening quarter, make it seven. After that, he can do that now. He can shoot, but he also will take it to the basket. Hey, you know, don't even look at it. Don't even look at his height and his weight. He's just tough underneath. And there's Bellinelli, In who says, I was hitting the belly. <laughs> In a rhythm. He got the bucket. Hornets lead reduced to one. Luther ahead at the free throw line. Each team now with 16 points scored at the line. Hornets had a, a large advantage early on in the game. Bellinelli straight up three. Whistle foul as Thornton ran wow. at Bellinelli, oh, okay. and Marco will get Marco three frees. Well, I'm a little surprised that they haven't attacked Marcus a little bit more tonight. Just called his number and gone at him to see if defensively he can handle it. Bellinelli with his third free throw try of the day. Just have combined to take 24 shots and have scored 35 points. So they haven't needed Marco to shoot as much as maybe we've seen in games recent. Bellinelli gets the first two. He's got one more after being fouled on the three-pointer. And we've seen that on this homestand already. Yes, but you know, but his lack of shooting, though, I think it affects.